The current leaders in the Czech Extra Liga and the Finnish Liga met on Wednesday to finish CHL Group F. Both Mountfield HK and Kerpet Olu have started well domestically this season, but only Kerpet is advancing to this year's CHL knockout stage. Mountfield has badly underachieved in Europe, but on home ice they got off to a bright start. Turnaround shot into the net from Mate Chalupa, beating UC Runes in the Kerpet net, opening the scoring seven minutes, 43 seconds in. The pass from Sebastian Pichier, and it was 1-0 for Mountfield. And later in the first period, 2-0, Michael Dragoon scoring. An assist to Mate Pavlovic and Radovan Pavlik. Point blank range, the shot from Dragoon in, 2-0. Mountfield trying to get a consolation three points to finish Group F. But Kerpet on the power play, the booming shot from Yanni Hakenpe into the net. Having the Mountfield lead, Yaroslav Pavelka beaten to make it 2-1 after one. Into the second period, Pavelka coming up big here. Good Kerpet passing maneuver, and Miko Niemela denied on the doorstep. Kerpet, though, would keep pressing, and the long outlet pass to Julius Hermanen. He gets the backhander into the net past Pavelka, and Kerpet all the way back to tie the game up at two apiece. Nice lofted pass down the ice, just gathered in time by Hermanen. Pavelka, should he have come out of his net? We'll never know. 2-2 into the third period now. It's Radovan Pavlik on the rush. Watch him fly solo and zip the shot past Runes to make it 3-2 for Mountfield HK. The relatively small crowd in Hradic Kralova enjoying that shot. And it seemed for a while as though that might be the game winner. However, clock ticking down towards four minutes left in the game and Otto Karvinen getting his second CHL goal of the year. Puck dug off the boards by Temu Kivihalme and Karvinen getting the puck into the net past Pavelka. We went to overtime. Great chance developing for Pavlik, looking for his second on the reverse feed from Mislav Rosendich, but no dice. Went to a penalty shootout and the sixth shooter for Karpet Olu, Radek Kobluzek, scoring what proved to be the winner. His second penalty converted in the shootout, and Kerpet get the two-point win and finish with 14 points in Group F.